Hello dear students, today we are going to learn about magnetic effect of electric current. Take a used to match box and remove the cardboard tray out from the match box. Wrap an electric wire around the cardboard tray a few times. Take a small compass needle. This is a compass needle. You have to place that compass needle inside the cardboard tray. Connect the circuit as shown in the diagram. Now note the direction to which the compass points. The compass needle is also a magnet having its end points in both north and south direction. As you can see here north and south direction it points towards. So take a bar magnet and move it near to the compass needle. Observe the compass needle carefully. When we move the bar magnet near the compass needle what happens? The needle gets deflected. Is it? Remove the magnet and turn the switch to own position. And now note the direction of the compass needle. And you may notice that there is a deflection in the compass needle when the current passes through it. Okay, that means when the switch is in the own position, then there is a deflection in the compass needle. That is the compass needle gets deflected due to the magnetic field induced by the current. Now turn the switch to off position and note the direction of the compass needle. Now the compass needle comes back to the original position. If you relate the two experiments where the compass needle is deflected by the magnet and by the wire carrying electric current. When the magnet is brought near or when the current flows through the wire, the magnetic needle gets deflected. So we can understand that the wire acts like a magnet when electric current is passed to it. This is called the magnetic effect of electric current. Electromagnets differ from normal magnet in one major way. They are made by passing an electric current through a wire that has been wrapped around the iron. The current creates a magnetic field and magnetizes the iron core. When the current is turned off, the iron loses its magnetism. The main advantage of electromagnet over the normal magnet is that they can easily start and stop and the strength of the magnetic field can be effectively controlled. When current flows through the circuit or the conductor it behaves as a magnet and magnet has a very important property that it attracts iron. Does the conductor carrying current also attract the iron? Let us find it through an activity. Take an insulated wire of around 80 cm. An iron nail, a cell, some drawing pins and a switch. First, wind the insulated wire around the iron nail tightly. This forms a coil. Makes a circuit connecting this coil, switch and cell as shown in the diagram. Connect the free ends of the wire to the circuit through a switch. Put some pins near the nails. Now turn the switch on so that the current flows. As soon as the switch turned on, the iron nails attracts the pin. As a result, the pin attracted to the iron nail. When we turn off the switch, the current stops and the pins no longer attract, attracted to the iron nail. 
the coil behaves as a magnet when the current flows through it when the current stops the coil loses its magnetism such a coil is called an electromagnet